All the activity and excitement and preparation. Go in now by class. The entourage, the, president, the vice president and everything has just arrived on campus and he should be coming by helicopter in a few minutes. There are protesters out in front of the school who are not in agreement with the vice president's policies. And the police are holding them off. This is where the vice president is coming in with his helicopter in the field. One of the teachers being interviewed by one of the television programs. Thank you. 
and a man is tough. And so in dealing with them, the doers of the day, we got to keep our own defenses up. And I want to see us get a 50% reduction in strategic arms. I'd love to be the president to get rid of uh, chemical and biological weapons. So, but keep the United States of America strong. Don't ask your president to go over there with some naive hope that this new nice guy will uh, meet our bid if we make our own cuts in the lab. That's the way I do it. Yeah, right here. Right.
the three dirtiest farmers in the, in the United States, and my opponent, who claims to be an environmentalist, was filing for exemption to keep from cleaning up Boston Harbor back in the, in the 70s. And the other thing he does, and this is factual, he goes down to New Jersey and says what he's going to do about cleaning up the environment. The very same governor that said he wants to dump the sludge and you know what out of Boston Harbor uh, off the coast of New Jersey. So I think he's got a little bit of a conflict there. But the big thing is we have to move forward by stopping ocean dumping and cleaning up our harbors and our waters. Yeah. What's the second part? Thank you. 
fight, you know, and some things, even intelligence and this kind of thing, it can be very helpful to the local police. But my view is we've got to be tougher on the criminal and have a little more respect for the victim of crime instead of having it the other way around. This is the last question.